Hey everyone, thank you for coming back to my channel. Thank you for joining me. If you're new to my channel, thank you for taking the time out to check out who I am. Please, but do not forget to subscribe and comment and share, like. And if you don't like, I don't care. It tells me that, hey, we all have opinions. Anyway, so this video is about couponing digital coupons if you don't have the time like I do and others do to click sit down and clip out coupons every week or whenever you get them it's okay no problem what you do is at grocery stores uh, pharmacies like CVS drug stores um, um, Best Buy I believe not too sure on Best Buy, but some loyalty, um, some stores with loyalty programs. That's what I'm going to just go ahead and say, call it what it is. Loyalty programs. And it is hot. I had this on earlier and I was not about to change. Anywho, first of all, this gorgeous background hey, is my shower curtain. I need some great lighting and it's dark. So my bathroom is the only one with good lighting. Anywho. If you want to tour my bathroom, let me know. Because I did this this summer and I am not about to change it. I love the beach scenery and I'm going to keep it like this until I feel like changing again. Now back to the subject at hand. So, if you, if you live in areas like Winn-Dixie, boom, I miss Winn-Dixie. Okay, offhand again. Whoever is watching this that is in corporate, you need to get Winn-Dixie back to North Carolina, okay? Like, seriously, we need a Winn-Dixie in the Triangle and Triad area, okay? Mainly Triangle, the city, okay? Not saying which city, but the city. Anywho, <laughs> sorry for my camera shaking. I I had to do some little setup because my tripod is only six and a half inches, 6.7 inches long, tall, whatever. <laughs> and out of pocket, if you're looking at this, <laughs> shut up on the long. Okay, anywho, back to what I was saying. If you, food lion, that's what we're going to say because that's big in North Carolina. If you are a food lion grocery shopper, and you have the MVP card. Well, you go make an account, you get digital coupons, and then their coupons are in their whole coupon thing is called Coupon Hub. That's what they're called, and that's what it you keep store your digital coupons. You go in there, you add the coupons to whatever um to your coupon hub and whatever you're gonna get, or just add them all. And you um, got your coupons there. You don't have to worry about clipping coupons or anything. Boom. You didn't clip coupons. You go shop. Put in your phone number. Do, 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 do. And or, or you have them to scan your, your MVP card. Now, you don't have to take an MVP card. You could just use a phone number. Or, and if you have the Food Lion app, you can... <clears throat> just um, have them to scan the card from the app. Those are digital coupons on there. Great coupons. And remember, only one coupon per item. So, you don't have to clip. You got your, you, you, you coupon right there. Now, same thing goes with other, with drug stores. Um other grocery stores that you shop at or other department stores or whatever I only the only ones that I do know of and can talk about is CVS, Rite Aid, Walgreens, Food Lion, Dollar General and Family Dollar. Now with Dollar General you go and make an account on uh, dollargeneral.com and find the DG the di digital DG digital coupons and you don't have a card for Dollar General and you do the same thing for Family Dollar and 
put in make an account a free account and when you go shop you put in your phone number that you use to make the account and then you go but before you go shopping you have to load those coupons to your account that's basically it it's very simple and easy and remember that it's always one coupon per item one per one item or per two items whatever the coupon requires so you have to be mindful to read the coupon so you don't get up to the register and looking stupid thinking that you're gonna argue the cashier down and your butt is wrong and the cashier is like i ain't taking your coupons out mm -mm, don't want that to happen where it's 2018 people we all know how to read so be smart about it um what else did someone ask me to talk about mm. But if I was supposed to talk about something that you asked me to talk about and I did not talk about it, please let me know in the comments below. Rebates. I have a um, video already on rebates, but I'll give a brief uh, analysis or whatever you want to call it. I, I'll be brief with the rebates because you can go find the um, video. It is titled Chit Chat money making apps or something like that but the first uh, words are chit chat with me or it's chit chat so you um download the apps and i have ibotta saving star fetch rewards um walmart savings catcher through walmart check out 51 i have all those listed and or linked down below and you can use my code to sign up. Trust me, when you use my code, you help yourself out. You help me out. You help your entire team out. When I say help out, you get money for signing up. Now, boom, let me tell you how you do that. So, I bought it since that's a very popular app. Download the Ibotta app. Put when they ask you for a referral code or your friend's code, whatever it asks you for, you put in my code. And after that, they'll give you tell you you have a certain amount of days to claim rebates. Before you go shopping, do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. And plus unlock. I said plus because it's a little circle with the plus. Tap on that to unlock the rebates that you're going to buy. I unlock every single rebate and I'll tell you why later. Because if you don't unlock the rebates and you go buy this stuff and you thinking you're going to upload your receipt, no rebates is not going to come up. Now, you have to unlock to get your money. The most popular rebate that I always do is any receipt for a particular store, whatever store you have on there in your area that you shop at, get 25 cents back whenever they put it up there. They always do that. So I always keep my receipts. Now the reason why I unlock every rebate is because I pick up receipts when I go shopping and I see a receipt on the ground dollar signs go off in my head like that's money get that receipt and i upload them sometimes you have to scan the item and if i don't have that item i'm not gonna worry about scanning the receipt but i'll scan it when it says any any receipt i ain't gotta scan nothing but the receipt select any receipt boop 25 cents in my account and for Ibotta, you have to have $20 to cash out, either PayPal, Venmo, or certain uh, gift cards. You're going to say prepaid, but no, gift cards. And it'll be a list of the gift cards on there that you see when you make your account. And that's it. The minimum is $20 that you can cash out at. But you have to have Venmo or PayPal. I don't do Venmo. 
I don't know anything about Venmo. I don't have any interest for Venmo. I like PayPal and I'm set with PayPal. So my um, PayPal um, link to sign up under me will be down there as well in the description box below. So check all of that out. And I thank you for joining me. I thank you for watching. If you have any questions about the rebate apps, just go to that chit chat video, refer back to that and watch it. I'm not going to tell you all about it when I already have a video and it's a recent video. I did it in December. So it's, it's very recent. December of last year, nothing hasn't changed. So thank you for watching. Please come back and please give me a thumbs up if you like it. If you don't, you have your own opinion, give me a thumbs down. And thank you very much. You see the symbol, right? NC State Wolfpack. Wolfpack, we won again. Boom. All right, guys, thank you. So I'll see you guys later. Remember, pour no more. Do not pass over opportunities repeatedly, okay? This is 2018. I need you guys to come up on the come up, okay? All right, peace out, ladies.